Hi, hello, good evening, and welcome to the live video. This is mental training, and I'm Gina K speaking. I'm here with all my, you know, my friends, my family members. Um, you can see them at the back. Hi, everybody. Hi. Hope you hope you hope you're all doing well. All right. Okay. So, um, before I start today's, um, should I say lecture or whatever you like to call it? Um, I'd like to wish a very, very important person in my life a happy birthday. Uh, so uh, uh, that's my mother actually, and you know, your she, your mother is like the most important person in your life uh, before other people start coming in. You understand? Uh, because I came into this world through her. Okay. Okay. So I, I'm going to sing happy birthday songs to her. Uh, don't mind my voice. <coughs> Happy birthday to you, happy birthday to you, happy birthday dear mommy, happy birthday to you, happy birthday to my sweet mother and you know I love you so much, you are the best, you are the best mother in Nigeria, uh, I, I, you are the best mother I have, you are the best mother I know, <laughs> alright, okay so yesterday we were talking about 10 dangers of um, success. Yeah, because you take the shift your chair so that you not shake that thing. You know this thing. Is. All right. Okay. All right. We are back. Sorry, that was just a slight um, a hiccup. All right. So we are back. Okay. So now number six. Number six. Uh, no problem. Go ahead. Go ahead. The number six danger of success is what? Yeah. Alright, remember we are talking about ten dangers that successful people should guide against. So, we mentioned the first five. Um, can anybody rem remember anyone from yesterday? Yeah, you should not forget where you come from. Anyway, without wasting any time, let's just jump straight to number six. Now, successful people, they sometimes they, they reduce their zeal and commitment. Whenever you, redu you, you reduce your zeal and your commitment, you know, you stop being passionate about that thing that you started, you know, being, you know, started pursuing success for. Uh, as in, that's, that's very dangerous and you lose your, you lose your, um, you, hi, welcome, good afternoon, ma'am. Uh, you lose your, you start losing your success. You start losing your success. So, you don't reduce your zeal and don't reduce your commitment. And then, number seven, they become unteachable. Why do you become unteachable? You don't become unteachable. Uh, when you become unteachable, like you have lost the humility that is necessary for you to receive certain correction, to receive certain, you know, you know, how do I put it, guidance from those who have gone ahead of you. Don't become unteachable. Don't ever raise your shoulders to, you know, a, a stage where nobody can talk to you again. When you become unteachable, that's a very dangerous, um, that's, that's dangerous. Don't become unteachable. Don't become what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Then, number eight, they overestimate their importance. That's another danger of success. The successful will start overestimating their importance. You should never start raising your shoulder. You should, not, you should never start feeling too big. Don't ever feel too big. Don't ever feel that you are irreplaceable. When you start overestimating yourself, you start making yourself feel like nobody is better than you, that nobody can do, uh, nobody can do anything better than you. Is there a problem? Uh, then you want to join us. Come inside now. Uh, uh, then you start, you start, you start becoming uh, like you start being as if now only use now only you work at home. Start being as if you are the best, you are the greatest. No, 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 no. Don't overestimate their importance. Have this mentality. Soldier come, soldier go. Barracks do what? Uh, hey, barracks remain. So don't ever overestimate your importance. Number nine, they start surrounding themselves with the wrong people. That's another danger that successful people face. You start surrounding yourself with uh, the wrong people. Let me tell you the story of a king and some psychophants. A king was surrounded by yes men, psychophants, that whenever 
he asked them anything, they will always say yes sir, yes sir, yes sir, yes sir. So there's one particular person that was always giving him, you know, a different advice. And that thing used to pain the king. That thing used to provoke the king. So, do you know what he did one day? He now went and ordered for Unkuelu, bitter one, bitter pan wine. You understand? The one that is very bitter. So he shared, he shared it to all of you. They say, as you are going higher, you, there is a target on your back. The higher you go, the bigger the target becomes. You understand? That is why you see that nobody likes staying at the top too long. That is why you see they like pressuring all these politicians or presidents. Before you know, okay, let's use the, the British House of Representatives. Uh, I don't know what they call it. I think House of Commons, I think. Before you know, you hear that the Prime Minister has resigned. The Prime Minister has resigned. Because they're always putting pressure on them, always targeting them. So uh, you start becoming a target for shame and a fall. That is the tenth uh, danger. Now, you have to ensure that if you don't, if, 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 as in, how many times have we seen celebrities commit suicide and overdose on drugs? How many times have we seen celebrities break down and end up in drug and alcohol rehabilitation? A word is enough for the wise. All right? A word is enough for the world? Wise. All right, all right. Okay, so uh, first of all, does anybody have any question? Does anybody have any question? Oh, nobody has any question. So should I ask my own question? Yeah. All right. So the man by my left-hand side, what did you learn today? Okay. All right. I see. The people at my back, do people learn anything? Yes. Uh, yes. Oga, what did you learn? Hmm. All right, all right. That's 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 good to know. That's good to know. Thank you. Clap for him. Clap for him. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks. That's very impressive. All right. So, um, thank you so much for listening to me and my people today. We're really grateful. Um, man of the future, my next thing coming very soon. So, you better start uh, looking for it. The movie will soon drop. The date has not yet dropped yet. It's still undergoing post production. So, Man of the Future is coming soon. Uh, that's my next movie. Start looking forward to it. Like and subscribe and uh, follow this page. Share this. Uh, if you find it insightful, share it to your friends. Tell them learn about the dangers of success you know they're always telling us how to be successful nobody has ever taught us how to fail so very soon i'm going to teach you how to fail how to be a failure you understand i've you, you noticed that you know there are so many books and tutorials on how to be a success and uh, they'll start telling us 10 successful nigerians or 15 successful nigerians but nobody tells us who are the failures nobody tells us who are the failures so we have to start learning how to fail and tomorrow also we'll talk about how an idle mind cannot make you great all right so thank you so much for watching and don't forget to like and subscribe bye bye bye